Here's Mr. Edison in a reminiscent mood in 1927 to mark the 50th anniversary of his invention of the phonograph. He gave a repeat performance of the first words ever recorded. Here they are as picked up from the soundtrack of an Edison movie made in Llewellyn Park, New Jersey. The uh, first words I spoke in the original phonograph. A uh, little piece of practical poetry. Mary had a little lamb, its speech was white as snow, and everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Little Nero, October the 5th, 1888. Now listen to the voice of Sir Arthur Sullivan. Dear Mr. Edison, for myself, I can only say that I am astonished and somewhat terrified at the result of this evening's experiment. Astonished at the wonderful power you have developed and terrified at the thought that so much hideous and bad music may be put on record forever. But all the same, I think it is the most wonderful thing that I have ever experienced, and I congratulate you with all my heart on this wonderful discovery. Arthur Sullivan. Grieved 
And then I sat down on the end of the fender to wait on the kettle coming through the bale. And it was sitting about a quarter of an hour when I fell fast asleep. And do you know what wakened me? Eh? <laughs> I'll be you, Bob, you don't know. <laughs> well, it was the kettle sitting on the fire, singing to the teapot on the hob. <laughs> oh, a Roman in the gloaming on the banks of clay. Roman in the gloaming with my lassie by my side. But my son is gone to rest. That's the time that we love best. Lovely Roman in the gloaming. Oh, you can't beat it. <laughs>
Thank you. 